Hi everybody, Beanmeister22 here. Hey, today we're gonna look at something really cool. This is the Lego Creator Maersk Line Triple E Container Ship, set number 10241. Ages 12 and up, 1,518 pieces and a whole lot of stickers on those containers. Yes, this is Lego's new container ship. Well, you're going to say, it's not that new. Well, you know, it was new when I bought it. I bought it the first day it was released. In fact, I bought it early release. And now I'm just finally getting to making a video about it. Yeah, I know. So, yes, we have been sitting on this for quite some time. And then we built it. And then we were sitting on it for a longer period of time until I finally got this filmed yesterday. So I'm very excited about getting this video up because it's a really cool ship. But I am also disappointed. And let me tell you why. And to tell you why, we're going to have to go back a few years. Now, a few years ago, I bought that Maersk container ship. Wow, yeah, great. In fact, I bought two of them. And I loved those sets. So when they had this set coming out, man, I got to get it. I got to get it. So then I got it and I said, wait a minute, it's not the same scale. The scale is off. What do you mean the scale's off? Oh, this ship should be humongous compared to that container ship when in fact it's about the same size. And what's wrong with that? If it's about the same size and it should be humongous compared to it, then that means it's not scaled the same. Very disappointing. And truly, if this was the same scale size as that other mare ship, this thing would be huge. I mean, look at the containers here. Here's the containers from the older mare container ship, and this is the ones from this one. I know, kind of disappointed in this. I wanted them to be able to sail side by side. When in fact, this container ship can fit on the deck of my Brick Tech aircraft carrier. And really, it would fit on the... Chinese aircraft carrier for the Sluban one. It would also fit on the Kitty Hawk, the Mega Bloks one, and it will definitely fit on the Ban Bao aircraft carrier. So this really isn't scaled right to sail side by side with our existing Lego and Brick Navy. See, that's what's disappointing. Okay, with all that said, let's talk about the build. Fairly easy build. Nothing complicated or difficult here. Yes, there's a lot of stickers to put on, but yes, you really need to put the stickers on if you want them to be Maersk containers. If you don't want this to be a Maersk ship, you don't have to mark the containers with the Maersk stickers. You can put anything on them you want to. And really, with a little bit of ingenuity, you could probably turn this into a hinge inline ship. Just don't put the Maersk markings on it. See, very cool, it's versatile. All right, so easy build, reasonably priced. It could be a lot more expensive than it was. Really, I was surprised at the price. This is in the Creator Series. It's an expert build, and really it isn't an expert build, but I think they're calling it an expert build because instead of playing with it, you're supposed to put it on a display stand. I don't know. It, expert, it really wasn't that hard to put together. I know, I know, I'm going to get a lot of comments that said, well, you know, it's not supposed to be made for playing. It has a display thing and a stand. And yeah, hey, the display thing and the stand, very cool. Also, another cool aspect is propellers on the back and your rudders, very cool. And on the side where you have those clear viewports to see the motors, the engines, very cool. But as cool as that is, not very realistic. And you know, that's what we look for around here. Realism, being realistic, looking really cool but really cool and realistic. And for those of you who don't already know, why do I want realism in ships? Because I used to work on ships, from oil tankers to container ships to Navy ships. You know, I kind of like the real things. Just when I do the battle tanks, I want them to look real. And even the spaceships, they got to look like real spaceships, right? So yes, very cool set. 1,518 pieces, ages 12 and up. Set number 10241, 26 inches long, very cool. And if you get a chance to see this ship in real life, that would be even cooler. Now, am I going to keep this? No, I'm not. In fact, I'm going to give this away. Don't ask for it. I've already selected who I'm going to give it to. Someone who kind of gave me a hand with this set. But why give it away, you ask? Well, because it's not scaled properly. You know, that's a good enough reason right there. Remember how it looks compared to the aircraft carrier? This thing should be bigger than the aircraft carrier, or at least comparable in size, right? 
So if you like ships and navy builds, you will probably like this set. If you want it to be scaled comparable to your other ships and navy builds, then you may not like this set. It really depends what you're looking for. It's a fun build. It's a cool ship. It's a cool ship in real life. It's a cool ship in the brick world. And it comes with that display stand. Very cool. All right, so what do you think? Cool set or not cool set? Do you have this set? Well, by now, a lot of you probably have it. When I bought it, you know, you may not have had it. So I probably should have did this video when it first came out. Yeah, I don't know. Leave your comments in the comment section. And hey, as always, thanks for watching. Beanmeister 22, the most dangerous man on YouTube.